smoke so much weed you wouldn't believe and I get Welcome to India the Superpower Part 4 The Tupolev f 222 m is a supersonic, variable sweep wing, long-range strategic and maritime strike bomber developed by the Tupolev Design Bureau. According to some sources, the bomber was believed to be designated 226 at one time. 222 m 3 has a top speed of Mach 1.88 and will easily sustain Mach 1.6 for extended periods and can carry 53,000 pounds of weapons. Single 222 M3 can carry 10 Rajaga KH-15 anti-ship missiles or 3 massive Rajaga KH-22 missiles both of which can hit speeds of around Mach 5.0. A single 222 M3 can be effectively tasked to take on a large fleet of naval warships in the open sea and can be successfully used to ensure naval blockade. Soviets in past have carried out simulated dry runs on US carrier battle groups with very positive results. Number four. K-15 Sagarika is a nuclear-capable submarine-launched ballistic missile with a range of 750 kilometers, 466 miles. It belongs to the K-missile family and forms a part of India's nuclear triad and will provide retaliatory nuclear strike capability. Development of the K-15 missile started in the late 1990s with the goal of building a submarine-launched ballistic missile for use with the Indian Navy nuclear-powered Arahant-class submarines. It was developed at the Defense Research and Development Organizations DRDO, missile complex in Hyderabad. The development of the underwater missile launcher, known as Project 420, was completed in 2001 and handed over to the Indian Navy for trials. On November 25, 2015, a dummy or unarmed K-15 Sagarika missile was successfully test-fired from INS Arahant. In December 2015, it was reported that the K-15 missile has entered production. Nearbay is an all-weather, low-cost, long-range cruise missile capable of carrying conventional and nuclear warheads. The missile has a range of more than 1,000 km, weighs about 1,500 kg and has a length of 6 meters. Uses turbofan engine and the missile is guided by a highly advanced inertial navigation system. The missile is capable of flying at different altitudes ranging from 500 m to 4 km above the ground. Prithvi Air Defense, PAD, is an anti-ballistic missile developed to intercept incoming ballistic missiles outside the atmosphere. Based on the Prithvi missile PAD is a two-stage missile with a maximum interception altitude of 80 km, 50 miles. Guidance is provided by an intershield navigation system with mid-course updates from LRTR and active radar homing in the terminal phase. PAD has capability to engage the 300 to 2000 km. 190 to 1240 miles class of ballistic missiles at a speed of Mach 5 Number one. Advanced Air Defense AAD is an anti-ballistic missile designed to intercept incoming ballistic missiles in the endo atmosphere at an altitude of 30 kilometers 19 miles AAD is a single-stage, solid-fueled missile. Guidance is similar to that of PAD. It has an inertial navigation system, mid-course updates from ground-based radar and active radar homing in the terminal phase. It is 7.5 m, 25 feet, tall, weighs around 1.2 tons, 1.2 long tons, 1.3 short tons, and a diameter of less than 0.5 m, 1 foot 8 in. 
On November 23, 2012, India again successfully test-fired its homemade supersonic advanced air defense AAD, interceptor missile from a defense base off the coast of the eastern state of Odisha.